Hi, this tutorial is just going to go through some brief definitions of the mean and the range. Um, both of these will come up on the functional skills exam and basically they are present in the third section of the exam to do with data and data representation. Both of them are ways of analysing sets of numbers and data. So if we just go start with the mean. Um, the mean is also called the average um, and the way to calculate this is take the total number of items and divide those by the number of items that you have. So basically if you have a set of numbers you are basically adding them together and then dividing them by how many there are. Um, I have a set of data here that we can just try that with. So there's been a survey done and these are the ages of the participants. They've been split into male participants and fe female participants. So what I want to do is find out the average age for both. Um, the way to do that then is to add the ages together and then divide by how many there are. So we're going to add these ages together for the male participants and then divide them by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, so we'll just pull my calculator up. I can do that here. So it's 23 plus 34 plus 19 and I know this seems long-winded but this is the way that you have to do it in the exam um, and also write it out in the working out box just so that the examiner can see where you're getting your answers from and the last one is 21 so then I've got my answer which is 226. Uh, what I'm going to do then is, like I said, divide by how many participants there are, which is seven male participants. So I'm going to divide by seven, and it's going to give me the average age of the participants, which is 32.285 and so on. Um, I can round that off to about around 32 just by looking at this number here and because it's below 5. So I'm just going to write in there the average age of the male participants is 32 and that looks about right looking at those ages there. So the same thing can be done for the female participants. All you would do then is just add these ages together. And then again, because there's seven participants, you would divide by seven and get the average age. So it's just important to remember that the mean and the average are the same thing. So if you're calculating the mean, you are calculating the average. It, it's um, interchangeable. Uh, the range is the difference between the highest and the lowest numbers in your set of data. Another way to put that is it's the biggest number, take away the lowest number. So if I do this for the female participants, then as you can see in this set of data here, the highest number is 45 and the lowest number is 21. So again, you want to write this down or put that into your calculator during the test. So I'm doing 45, take away 21, and I get 24. So the range for that set of data is 24. And that's how you calculate the range.